Jack's Peak is approximately 530 acres in size. Um, it's, it's a pretty large park for it uh, being so close to the city. It's a beautiful park. Jack's Peak is really unique compared to the other parks in the county because this is the park that's closest to the Monterey area. It's all pine trees, Monterey pines, exclusively in this park. If you walk around, you see pine needles down on the ground. It's just very scenic and beautiful and it overlooks the ocean. You get a nice coastal breeze here. It's one of my favorite parks in the county. This park has a lot to offer the outdoor enthusiasts. The weather is nice and it's shaded more by trees. It has over eight and a half miles of hiking trails here and horse trails as well. Mostly all the trails here are pretty accessible for everyone. There, there are some hills, but they're mostly just rolling slightly hills, but most of them are all, all pretty uh, easy trails here, unless you start at the bottom. Obviously, you can climb up the mountain to get to it, but if you're up here at the parking lot, it's pretty intermediate, I would say, here. Usually the Earl Mosier Trail or the Skyline Self-Guided Nature Trail is a popular one here, and uh, I can take you out there and show you some of that, and the views are beautiful out there. That's why people take it a lot. I think some people, what they really like about it is it's totally natural. We don't really do anything here. We just try to keep the natural scenery. Of course, if a tree falls, we clear it and stuff like that, but we don't go and develop it like other uh, things out in the world it is today. It's just pretty much a natural setting, and I think uh, people really enjoy that here. I was talking to one person. They came over here to, uh, they heard from the San Jose area about uh, a woodpecker and they came here to look for it and uh, they thought it was nesting here and some other birds. Uh, that was uh, last year I heard that story from a gentleman. So some people come out here just to, like I said earlier, look at the views as well as look at the native habitat that's here in the park. So yeah, we're on the self-guided nature trail at the edge of the West End parking lot. Um, it's the first trail right uh, next to the parking lot so it's easily accessible and we'll come up to uh, the first post for the self-guided trail and it's a little card on it and it uh, tells you a description of what you're seeing and uh, they're marked in a order of by numbers so the first one is number one obviously and it just uh, a brief description it talks about the walk where you're going and the plants and there's pictures to court uh, to look at it when you're talking to see what you see against the pictures uh, so yeah, we can continue on. This is gonna be, I don't know, approximately 100 yards to the next station. So it's a little bit of a hike, but it's pretty gradual. It's not too steep, so most people can make it. There's a lot of people that are older um, that come out here to enjoy it. And uh, our maintenance guys along the way put little chairs for people who can sit, which is pretty cool out of a tree that fell, so that's pretty cool, just uh, using the native habitat to put stuff in. And if you look off to the right, you can see uh, Monterey off there, you can see the bay and Pacific Grove, and then right up here is the uh, next station about 100 feet up. All right. So here's the next station, it overlooks, like I said, the, the bay, Monterey, and the wharf off to your, right in front of you here. The beautiful view, if you come out to Jack's Peak, you can see views like this and uh, enjoy a nice hike with your family. And this board right here below you uh, talks about what you can be looking at out in front of you, which is pretty nice. 
talks about Canary Row, uh, Monterey Bay Aquarium, and different landmarks out in front of you. So after this station that's overlooking the bay here, if you continue behind me down the trail, it takes you to other stations uh, to read the cards and look at views, and then eventually you'll become, you'll be at an area that uh, will overlook Carmel Valley, and it has a bench, and then it'll loop around throughout other stations, and it'll take you back to the parking lot, and that's about a mile total, so it's not that bad of a hike, and as you can see, there's benches in between to stop and rest and beautiful views. Um, so come out and uh, enjoy Jack's Peak and uh, support Monterey County Parks Department. Other things offers here on the on the east end of the park, we have barbecue areas. We have pedestal barbecues. There's about 15 on the east end here, where you can enjoy the barbecue area here with your family and enjoy a picnic in the park. And then right here at the head of the is a trailhead for Earl Mosier Trail. So pretty close to the parking lot is uh, trail access. So that's a good point to uh, come out and enjoy the park here at the east end. There is one reservable area here at Jack's Peak County Park, which is called the Monterey Pines Group Area. It's a very private group area. You'll have your own parking area there, your own restrooms, your own water, your own barbecue pit, and your own personal tables, which is really nice when you're having a, a get together with your family. It, it's just, just for you guys and no one else will bother you there. So that's a really nice feature there for just a small amount of money. Over here, I would say we get a different uh, amount of people for hiking. This is more hiking related, this park. People are coming here exclusively for hiking and enjoying the environment and, and the views, um, not just a barbecue here. Toro is more of a barbecue place to interact with the family and play on the grass. Here, like I said, it's more natural setting. So there's no real grass here. It's just more natural on the grounds, pine needles and stuff like that. Um, so people are coming here to admire the scenery, the views, and what actually the habitat has to offer, offer them here at the Monterey uh, side of the, the mountain here uh, at Jack's Peak County Park.